get that sword out of here. Can I steal it? Oh my god, I want to steal it. Damn it! If Ryan could have finished my Templar sword in time, I'd be the one still standing. Yeah, sure, whatever. This battle is over. There's no reason to keep fighting. Now get out of Trista and take the squad by the west exit with you. Green. All right, this should be all the backup they need at the west exit, and then some. Damn. Whoa, whoa, hold up just a sec. Oh, no. Aren't you forgetting something? Uh... <gasps> that voice. Something's coming. Looks like the one I have. Yeah, it does. <laughs> it is. Whoa. A blue knight? Then Valimar wasn't the only divine knight that was awoken. See? Am I ever glad to see you? The Azure Knight? So he was an awakener all along. <sighs> I'll bet she's the one who guided him to it, too. Oh, Misty. Crow. Crow! Are you really in there? Sure am. Long time no see, Green. Oh, well, not too long, I guess. Seeing as we just had dinner together last night. But that all feels strangely distant now, you know? Another lifetime, almost. Why? doing this are you really the one who shot the chancellor and where did you even get that thing it's thanks to the imperial liberation front's planning that i wound up at the academy in the first place it was a nice spot to bide my time while we waited for our chance to take out the chancellor Gotta say, though, the whole school thing was a lot more fun than I expected. Almost makes me sad to leave it behind. But at the end of the day, I'm C. That's the real deal. The crow armbreast you've known all this time. He isn't real. He never was. Like hell he isn't! All the good times we had? Your friendship with Toa, and Angelica, and George? Do you seriously want me to believe that all of that was just a lie? That our hanging out, our field studies, even our concert meant nothing to you? I'm... Yeah. I'm afraid so. Oh no. Crow, why are you doing this? No, I want the sword. No! To me. That's nice. Reinford made that for the Soldots units. I know it's not the kind you're used to, but it's the best you're gonna get right now. So, what do you say we settle things once and for all? Ah! A double saber. Just like C used. Then there's no room left for doubt. Crow really is C. I take no joy in this, but we can't have that ashen knight of yours getting in the way later down the line. So I'm afraid I'm gonna have to bust it up, along with the academy. As for you students in the staff, you'll be under our jurisdiction. 
So that's the plan if you win, huh? But what about if I win? <laughs> if you win, I'll pay up the interest I owe you on that 50 Mira. Oh dear. Hell, we could even trade places. I'll babble on about friendship and dreams, and you can have fun for once in your life. You've got yourself a deal. And I hope you know what you just signed up for. Because the Bank of Reen has the highest interest rate on the continent. Oh, the eyes. <laughs> I don't know if that's a good line or a bad line. <laughs> Kind of wonderful. It's kind of both. I love it. <laughs> if we'll be trading places, don't forget you'll have a mountain of work waiting for you back at the academy. So one way or another, you'll be coming back with us, Crow. <laughs> you got some real stones. I'll give you that. But sure, I'll agree to those terms. <laughs> this is bad. Their will to fight is causing an enormous outpouring of mana. Alright, let's do this. So. Well. Okay, um... The S fight is essentially a warm-up. It's taught us what we need to know about finding weaknesses and exploiting them. It's important to do so in this fight. That was wrong. So, neutral stance body is not it. Now he's in a different stance. Uh. Arn? <laughs> no. Oh, God. Okay. Arca Slash. So, it wasn't body. So, I can tell you right now, this is arms. Okay. Cool. The margin of error in this fight is not super high. Assist. I think this is body. Okay. Now! Here goes! Uh. Back to neutral, we know what it is. It's also gonna give you a rush. Body. Or the next one, though. No, this is arms. Ah, oh, shoot. Body was the one we just did. I am getting my stances mixed up. That's body. Now, here goes. Right, the next one will be a rush. This one's also body. Yep, hasn't okay. changed. I'll have to consider healing soon. Yeah. My sword will lead the way. Yeah, that's why this fight gets tough. Uh, okay, neutral stance. That is body. No. It's arm. <laughs> yes. Ah, his stance you hit his body like... again with this one. I swear to God. <laughs> his stance all look the same to me. It's... He's, gl he's glowing on one of them. <laughs> this is body. Okay. He's got the r halo around him. No! That's it! You're finished! He's hitting my weaknesses too! Okay, body! <laughs> what? Ah! Beat this! This is going very badly! <laughs> That's it! You're finished! <laughs> Can't lose. Ah! <laughs> okay. This 
Price's body. Right? I Am think I crazy? So. We just missed on one of them, though. That's what makes me worried. Yeah, that's why I'm concerned. I thought that was it, but I'm, like, losing my mind now. I don't even know anymore. Yeah, I don't see the differences between these two. I don't know. Okay. I think that was... Here goes. Since he was building up to his rush, I think that's why that was a different Not one. Bad. I think that one was head. Oh. Yeah. Think you can handle this? I do have crafts that I've completely you forgotten sure about. do. Uh, let's see, what do I got? What's the best one, I guess, is the question. Does it matter? Uh, well, considering your fragile health state, Morning Moon's going to be one of the ones we go to here pretty often. Okay. I'm going to have to hope for counters. If it counters and it imbalances, you'll be able to rush. Bring it on! We only have so many of these, though. There we go. And it does that, so now we rush. Nice. Still in precarious position here. Yeah. Should I do it again? We have to consider it. What's the I... one above it do again? It's the buff? Yeah, strength I'm... and speed, though. Yeah. We wanted that earlier. I mean, we're not really worried about imbalancing, per se, so... Yeah. And I'd rather be safe than sorry. So... Eat this! Oh! Nice. Good. Good. Oh! Blood, this thing is vital. Yeah, holy cow! Alright, this is a defensive stance he has now. Do not attack him. Okay. Because of that, you're gonna have to go to his buff. We this have no is. healing abilities left, so we can't do that. The only other option is attack, so it's going to have to be this. Yeah. It's the only thing that won't provoke his counterattack. Uh, this will pay dividends down the road, but... Think you can handle this? It's going to go again, unfortunately. Despite ah. the speed boost. That's it! Here's your mind! He gets an S break two or whatever. They're probably dead. Craft. Yeah, that hurt a lot. Well, that sucks. We sure were. Battle is annoying. We no, do enemies in retry. Weekend. All right. All right. Let's Stupid. Do yeah, we can't be missing any follow-up attacks. <laughs> yeah. And we need to make sure we're not wasting CP, so if we get to full, it needs to be used. Oh, there you go. that's a thing? Yeah, it was showing before, too. Oh. Where? When you're targeting limbs. Where are the stupid stars? I don't see any stars. Because we haven't attacked yet this fight. Uh, okay, I wasn't even seeing that afterwards, though, so I don't know. Body, I think, is with a stance. No, body was with the halo. Yeah, so, by himself, it's arms. So arms is is right. Yes. I think so. Okay. Ugh. You're making me second guess it now. I had them right I, last time. I don't know. This is stressful. What's this? That's body. Okay. We haven't done it yet, so it doesn't show anything. Now. Here goes. That's it. You're finished. So now if you target his arms. Oh. Okay. I see. 
So it's basically telling me now which ones are like correct. Yes. On any oh. on any stance you've seen. Okay. And hit successfully. That's helpful. I'm gonna rush on deck. That is still gonna be, body. be good. And it has the stars. Hooray! Now, my sword will sweep away. I wasn't expecting to be learning a new combat system at the end of the game. Yeah, right? That's so weird. I don't know how I feel about it. Think you can handle this? Now, before you pick body here... Should I be crafting or stealing? Maybe. I want to see what happens when you pick body. So oh, this it's is not head. there. So it's because this is his... He's got basically a rush or whatever. He's doing a different attack, so... Oh, I see. This will be head. Okay. I think you're okay not healing for the moment. Now. Okay. Here goes. Now. It'll take you to 120. Eat this. 125. You can hit again. You're 130. Finished. You heal. Okay. Go to 180. And then you can start spending it. Can't lose. That'll be good. We like. Spending our CP on things. I think. I mean, this is this is actually gonna waste CP if you attack right now. I think you just go into the first uh, counter attack. Oh, the uh, this guy. Mor yeah. Morning. You're gonna hit for ten twice because you're gonna rush, and then you hit for five. So that's, that's at least ten CP wasted. Yeah. Think you can handle this? Didn't counter, unfortunately. But it still it still reduces damage, so like it's a win or a super win. Yeah. Now! Here goes! And this turn order is actually working out great for us because he's maintaining the stance. Yeah. So yeah, go ahead and take three turns in a row, you cheater. Yeah. <laughs> now we have a rush. So now I think you can go ahead and get away with one attack. We'll give you your rush. Now. Ah! It's like go for the square again. Not bad. Okay. Um. 73,000. Yeah, I think this is fine. We're going to want to try and keep enough CP to use counterattack when he goes into his defensive stance this time. Yeah. Last time we didn't have the option. That's it. You're finished. We also have to be careful not to get in range of dying to his S craft. Yeah, that too. But I think now is a good time to counter again because, once again, it's going to be a waste of CP. If we attack, yeah, it will reduce damage that's coming in. Eat this. It opens up space to heal and get 50 CP because we had way too much for that. Darkness. Come on. Gotcha. Nah. Yeah, <laughs> yeah, no thanks. Now, here so, goes. What you gonna get? How's this? That all? Think you can handle this? Uh, this is a close one. I honestly think you can... I think you can get away with countering again. I mean, I'll take it. I don't want to die. 35. But now you're going to counterattack and hit. And now your heal will get you back to 90 to counterattack again. Darkness! Right into our hands right now. There's a rush. He's so close. Gotcha. Now. Yeah. 
There we go. Second time the charm. Yeah, the problem was sitting on 200 CP because it's not like there's no like S crafts at least in this particular thing here. So yeah, <laughs> gotta spend it because otherwise, like he's just doing too much damage. We effectively only have yeah 180,000 health. Yeah. With the two heals, so. <sighs> he did it. Thank goodness. That means this can't be happening. <laughs> you really don't do anything halfway, do you? I thought I knew what you could do with your eight leaves training, but you're fighting on a whole nother level today. Good thing too, otherwise I'd never have stood a chance against you. Time to make good on our wager, Crow. You're coming back with us. We have a bad track record of this. Yeah. Yeah, we Bad sure do. track record. No. You've been piloting a divine knight for one day. I've been using mine for three years. Did you think I wouldn't have a trump card to play? Kind of. I mean, I thought maybe. I was hoping. <laughs> I don't like trump cards when they're used against me. Is that fun? Ah. Damn it! It's like I didn't even phase him. <laughs> My head! When a Divine Knight is damaged, the Awakener shares their pain. Just as I feared, it was too early. Or perhaps it may have been too late. How did it have been too late? Oh, late as in like we didn't, yeah, awaken on time. No! No, no you, you don't! don't. Oh, classmates coming through! Oh my god, you guys, you're so crazy. Oh no! <laughs> Green, are you alright? Guys, what are you doing? We are going to buy you time to get away from here. Run, while you still have the chance. I can't. I won't just leave you all here. You can, and you must! Heimdall's been occupied, and it's only a matter of time before we've got a full-blown civil war in our hands. They might have been caught off guard today, but the Imperial Army's full of elite soldiers. When the war starts, it'll be long and bloody. But it doesn't have to be like that. You and the Ashen Knight could change things. You could find a third way, like Prince Oliver was talking about. A way that doesn't bow to either faction. You can become the wind that changes the course of this conflict. Guys, I... No, I can't! You'll never make it against him by yourselves! Yeah, this is bad. Just run, please! <laughs> Just look at yourself. You're in no position to be worrying about us. Once you've escaped, we'll go join the instructors, so don't worry. Take care of him for us. Okay, Celine? Oh, the cat is is my partner Easier now. Said than done. Prolonging current battle poses the risk of sustaining irreparable damage. Immediate tactical retreat is advised. That voice! Are you. So, you've gathered enough power, have you? Well, we may have lost this battle, but at least we'll live to fight another day. Alright, get us out of here! As far away in Erebonia as you can take us! Command acknowledged, Charlie Cross. Wait, no! That's my call to make! Now we have a cat calling the shots. It is, Reen. You will not bear this burden alone. 
I will stand and fight here as your sword. And I swear to you, this blade shall not be broken. Not before it returns to your side. Laura! Might be. What? Okay. Okay. We are doing the sequel. I know we talked about Persona 5, but uh, no. What did not I, with that ending. What did I say to you? What you just say, it's like, oh, it might depend on this ending. And I was like, yeah, okay. But holy cow. Didn't I was, say any more about it without giving things away. No. Oh, my God. That's so crazy. Yes. Um... That was awesome! This game is very entertaining enjo and enjoyable. Yeah, it um, takes quite a turn at the end, doesn't it? Yeah, it does! I was not expecting that at all. I remember being like, oh, okay, so this is happening now. <laughs> yeah! Oh. oh, yeah, Mecca's now. Okay. Sure. <laughs> Let, let's do that then. This is fine. That's so sad. He got separated from everybody. Uh, oh, no. What's going to happen to everyone? Like, I mean, the crow and them talked about like taking him hostage. So it's probably what's going to happen. But like, still, though, they're fighting a giant monster robot. They sure are. <laughs> you guys are so brave. You brave souls, you. They couldn't even beat S. Yeah. With yeah. Reed. <laughs> <laughs> so they're probably very, very... Hey, get off my screen! I'm gonna go ahead and spoil it <laughs> and tell you, they're not beating C. <laughs> yeah, no, I don't think so. But they're gonna try, I guess. Make time for me to escape. So some people talk about how, like, oh, I always knew it was Crow. And I'm like, if you're saying that any time before the sequence with the miners, you're lying. Yeah, like, there's... I didn't even suspect him at all. Like, I don't even mind the idea of people suspecting him before that point, because there are a couple of other circumstances where he's a little sketch, but the idea that, like, oh, I knew... No, you didn't. Yeah, that's crazy. They did a, such a good job of, like, hiding that, and the reveal, like, came out of nowhere, and I was just like, what? Mind blown. People talk about how, okay, well, again, if the names correspond to something, then who else's name starts with C? I mean, sure, there's no one else that we know of, but, like, I don't know why people would assume Crow right away. Like, just because his name's with the C, that doesn't necessarily mean anything at first. Obviously, it, it does later, but... He's a good yeah. job of masking it because he uses different weapons. He's just using guns instead of his twin blade. Yes, and... yeah, that was smart, too. I was thinking about that as well. So, so Crow is a monster if he can use guns and a, a double saber thing. Uh, yeah. That's I, I never thought that the main villain was gonna be like one of our like party members. Very unexpected. Now there's some interesting questions that this raises, even not even counting what I know about two in the context, since we will get to it eventually, or maybe next. <laughs> um, yeah. For example, since Crow was with the group at Corellia Fortress. If he had really wanted to, I think it would not have been hard for him to have gotten those railway guns fired. Yeah, that's really true. That, so, that is a good point. why didn't he? Because he didn't want to expose himself then? I mean, maybe, but if that was really a vital mission standard, then I think that was the time to do it. Yeah. But the deception of his voice being on the thing, or C's voice, wouldn't have mattered anymore at that point. But then, like, I don't know. Maybe it's because Toa was there. We didn't yeah. see him hesitate momentarily when we talked about uh, the friends and all the stuff. So I yeah. don't know. I don't know. 
Lots of different options it could be. Maybe that wasn't the true objective at that point. Maybe it was just like a front and they were trying to, you know, make it a perceived threat. Yeah. Because they ended up wiping out the railway guns anyways. Yeah. That's true. And then they got blown up later. So... All right, so your review of the game. It's credits time, so it's time for this. Uh, great. I'm definitely glad for a sequel uh, because any nitpicks I had with the story and stuff is going to be addressed later on. So, um, I, I think the final dungeon placement was a little weird at first, but it worked out, so it's fine. Overall, the game's great. The story's great. The characters are great. The music is awesome. Combat is super fun. Like... Lots of positive things, I have to say. <laughs> yeah, I mean, I'm a huge fan of combat. Here we go. Oh. So run through the skies. Oh, Hold that thought. Oh, flying away. <laughs> That's so sad. Okay, continue. Music's great. I have a few issues with pacing. Some of those are created by going for more AP. And yeah. odds are, in the case of two, we're going to do some of that stuff off air just because I don't think it's that worth it. Right. Especially when it comes to the length of this and whatnot. Yeah. We will still do them, but we will not do them on air. It's my guess. We'll see. Right. Um, because that's what the, I think was the hardest sell for this was. This was almost 85 hours, I think, by the time we were done. Yeah. And let's be honest. Even though I don't mind the quaint little stories of some of those side missions, they are by no means necessary. Right. Yeah. It's just it, it's fun and it's fine for world building, but we do not need all of it in the videos for sure. Yeah, we'll get all the important stuff on air, but beyond that, it's like uh, <laughs> I, I, I don't regret that we did it this way, but it definitely caused this to last a lot longer than I anticipated. Yeah. Because, I mean, I can imagine the main story going a lot faster when you're not doing all that extra stuff. I mean, we're still going to do it, but at least not on recording. The recordings will go by faster. And, yeah, I appreciated the political intrigue and, like, the story, like, it felt serious. And, <laughs> yeah, just in case you had any doubts, thank God. Hey, at the time. Yeah. yeah if you played this when it first came out. Oh, there's all of our weapons. Yeah, they've joined the graveyard. No! <laughs> but there's a flower of hope? Uh, that, that, that looks hopeful to me. Um, I Laura's don't know. is front and center, too. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Well, we did it. Is this it? Do I have to press a button? Uh, I think it's going to offer you the choice to save because there's a new game plus and whatnot. Ah, I see. There it is, which we can do because you can import it into the second game. Ah, yes. Hence part of why the stuff with Laura matters. Also, you get those scenes at the end in addition to the stuff with the dance and the fireside chat and whatnot. Gotcha. I'm assuming new because that's yours. Uh, yeah, it wouldn't hurt to be safe. Yeah, I don't want I've to. already transferred mine into two, but you never know what might happen. So yeah. I would like to have mine around still. Yeah. The curious thing, of course, is how this is going to work with 3, because 3 is on PS4. And there may be answers to that already. I don't know. I'm staying away from anything with 3, because I do not want anything spoiled. Oh. It's out in Japan. Oh, it is out we in Japan. We should hopefully have it next summer-ish, given how long localization normally takes for Falcom. It's more than the standard these days. Oh, okay. A lot of JRPGs seem to be coming across in more like four or five months. Standard ones. Some other ones took longer, Persona 5. Yeah. I'm guessing because of Falcom's kind of smaller studio status, it's going to be next summer or so by the time we get three. But we are going to get it. Hey, that'll be good. And I've seen a few like character designs and stuff from it. But I beyond that, well. yeah. I've been staying way the hell away from spoilers. I don't want any part of that. And if you put one in the comments, I will delete the shit out of you. <laughs> exactly. Fair warning now. None of that nonsense. Like, I'm fine with talking about stuff that happens in the earlier games and references that even I haven't caught, because there's been a few throughout here that I don't know, especially from the Crossbell games. Yeah. But we ain't talking three. No. Nope. And you should not talk two either, really, just for her sake, because she'll still be playing through that, and it'll be new to her then. Yes, exactly. All right, so well. So no spoilers, y'all. None of that. <laughs> if you've been reading up on three, or if you're one of those people who can play it when you import it from Japan, which is cool, but also terrifying. Yeah, holy uh, cow. That's great for you. I'm waiting for it to come out in English. Yeah, I probably will as well. So, that is the end after God knows how many parts. Again, I'm guessing 140 by the time we edit this. But the end of our playthrough of Trails of Cold Steel. We will be playing the second one at some point. Whether it's that or Persona 5 next, I don't know for sure. But those are the two that are on deck for sure. So, I don't think there's any question about anything else coming up. But yeah, this is my one chance to plug. So, I will do so as always at the end of a playthrough. 
If you like the video, please let us know. You can click the like button. You can cl uh, click the subscribe button if you haven't already. You'll get more videos from our channel, including when we do the next playthrough. And if you want to, let us know in the comments what you liked, what you didn't like, what your favorite part of the playthrough was. I have a few things that stand out, but I'm curious to hear from you. Thank you for watching. We will see you next time.